I remember the first time that I ever went fishing. I remember I was really excited, but I had no idea how to fish. I had no idea what rod to use. I had no idea what bait to use, but somebody had to teach me. And a good mentor of mine taught me which rod to use, which bait to use, the technique to go fishing. And I remember fishing all night and the only fish I caught was a bait fish. Now, for many of us, fishing is just a weekend excursion. It's something that you do for fun. But to the disciples of Jesus, fishing was a way of life. I want to take you to Matthew chapter 4 and Jesus is walking by the Sea of Galilee and he encounters Peter and Andrew and this is what he tells them. Matthew chapter 4 verse 19. Come and follow me and I will show you how to fish for people. The text tells us that Peter and the disciples there fished for a living. That was their way of life. Same way that Jesus calls them, he says that now I'm going to teach you how to fish for people for a living. That's going to be your way of life, but I'm going to teach you. As a disciple of Jesus, Jesus is also going to teach us how to fish for people, meaning how are we going to catch people for his kingdom? Well, he's going to teach us how to talk with people. He's going to teach us how to love people so that they don't see us, but they see Jesus Christ. And the essence of being a disciple is to listen and to follow the master, but also doing what he says. So we have to live each day with an intention of fishing for people. And I know many of us don't know how to do that. And that's why we have to read our Bibles and we have to pray that the Holy Spirit teaches us. So my challenge to you this week is to pray that God teaches you, teaches me how to be a fisher of men. And that's our weekly word.